Hey everybody, um, so as many of you know, this is November 1st, so in order, and I'm going to be doing Movember for, to raise awareness and a little bit of green for men's health for the Movember Foundation. So during this entire month, I'm going to be growing a mustache, and it requires us on day one, November 1st, to do clean shave. So I realize, you know, I have a lot I'm going to need to shave off. So I may not do a continuous documentation, but I'm going to do the best. So here we go. Ooh. All right. <laughs> oh, what am I doing? Yeah, I know I probably should have you know, trimmed it down a little, but that's not how I roll. It's a brand new razor, I've been saving it for a while. It's a, it's a lot of hair already. Um, so yes, yeah, the Movember Foundation deals with the four biggest problems that face men and men's health, which includes prostate cancer, testicular cancer, physical inactivity, and poor mental health. And there's actually, if you're interested, for those of you out there who can't grow a mustache, that, I mean, I can't grow a mustache, but they actually have something called Move Ember which is you make a pledge to move for 30 days during the, during the month of November. Oof, look at that. Just look at that. I'm at the point of no return now. Oh, this is going to take a while. And so it's something, you know, I really want to get behind. You know, as a guy, it's kind of important that I worry about my health. Uh, and, you know, I think this is probably one of the easiest kind of forms of charity for me to do. I did a I did no shave November last year, raised one hundred and thirty four dollars. But I kind of like the mission statement better for <laughs> uh, November and what it stands for. So I'm gonna you know stop talking for a little bit and just record. Well, I'm uh, I'm back and I'm about halfway done, so I'm clean. Uh, that's that's pretty thick. Not so clean. Um. So, part of the reason why Movember requires you to do a mustache is you know that's something a guy can do. It's a representation of kind of I don't want to say masculinity, but you know. It, it's something easily recognizable and you can see. Because I know I'm going to be getting questions going forward of, Oh, Mike, where's your beard? Why'd you shave? Things like that. And that kind of opens up the question of, Hey, I'm doing this great thing for men's health. Uh, I just want to raise awareness and maybe get your support. So, I'm... I'm I'm sad to see my beard go. I'll be the first one to say it, but you know, it's for a good cause. And there is a quantifiable amount of beard in this thing. It's a little graphic, so I'm probably gonna wait and just keep, have the picture. 
but I won't do anything with it. So here we go, side two. And the mustache is gone. This razor taking an abuse right now. Alright, there we go. I gotta work with it. Oh, I cut myself. Great. As you can see, it's kind of tough to work through this all. I wish I had someone else to film me right now to make things a whole lot easier. I like cut on the edges, like fold it down. This is hard. There's a lot of work in this. I left my like beard to go once I found out I was doing November. I just like I didn't even trim it because I knew I'd be getting rid of it. And well, I'm paying for that now. All right, I will be uh, continuing to work on this. I'll be back in a little bit. All right, here I am. I'm I'm just about to finish up. a struggle but you know this is a struggle I'm going to be sharing uh, with my fellow Knights of Columbus brothers here at uh, Mason we have a group of 10 of us who are going to be doing exactly what I'm doing right now uh, all for the sake of men's health we are an organization that focuses on uh, making great men and kind of the prosperity of men through our insurance program. It's just a little bit left and then I'm clean. Alright, this is it. And I'm done. Clean shaven mic. Wow, it's been a long time. Uh, thank you for sticking with this video. Um, I really hope for your support over this next month. Maybe a little bit of money if you can afford it. Uh, and I will make sure to keep you updated throughout this next month. Take care. Hope to see. You. Hope to hear from you soon.